with Josh McDonald. In it comes. It's a good ball in, but the bar. Almost deceives Jack McIntyre, but it's Hazel. And I've, in the end, got to tip it behind for a. Um, it's just a very, very hard to deal with, it's a good ball in. But it's picked out of the air very nicely by Jack McIntyre. It was just a great. It was just a great air shot, wasn't oh, it, Borden? Before we're going anywhere, well, Gribbon's carrying the ball here now. Played it towards through here. could be a chance. Oh, it's a great it's save by Bland. Gribbon, who's promised me a goal. Oh, he's got it! He's got it! It's 1-0! It's 1-0! You've got a look at... Luke and Navarro didn't get their first, and Callum Gribbon <laughs> follows in. He's got his fifth goal of this season. you got to say, that's, you got to say it's against the run of play. It I is well and truly against the run of play. But you know what's crazy? He promised me a goal this Saturday. <laughs> Similar to Luke and Navarro, that's his fifth goal now and in the league. And, well, what a way to get it. You need to keep talking to the players to keep getting his goals. You'll certainly hear that in the exclusive interview, which will be aired next week. So watch if you're a fan, even for us, on commentary. I feel like we enjoy watching the way we're playing now. There's a, there's a, you know, it's read, it's, you can understand what he's trying to do. But a chance here for Hazel, who does very well to so event challenge him. Come in, and he's got on. Takes full advantage there. He does very well to just take it, take it past Joe Cummings, and it's 1-1. No, you got to say, it's a fabulous goal. Yeah, he can play. Fabulous goal for Jacob Hazel. That's his 22nd goal this season, and... Pro they probably deserve it, Anton. Yeah, you can't, you can't be, be good from that. They responded quickly, quick, quick, quick response there. Fifth minute, and it still is one-one. But a chance here for Whitby to grab a second. Sent long towards the back stick towards Rowe. Headed on by Dyke still, but it headed out of the air by Cy Lennigan, who does very well there. Just very well there, Cy Lennigan. And then it's headed off the line by Joe Cummings, of all people. It did look like it crossed the line, but. Wait, we found Wait, Side mate commanding that. Good bit of passage to play here. Looking for Luca Navarro. And is he going to stay on? Luca Navarro on this right hand side. Has he got a chance? And he's been, not like he's been completely wiped out. But he has. He's been completely wiped out. Two minutes into the second half, the referee is awarded Ratcliffe a penalty. That one, Tony, if you're listening still from back home. Chance for Luca Navarro. As he goes! Right into the bottom corner. No chance for Shane Bland. And it's Luca Navarro's 10th goal of the season. And Radcliffe find themselves two minutes into the second half. 2 1 off. You love it. You've got to love it. It's a fiery start to the second half. Some I thought it controversial, but. Well, it was a definite penalty. He was completely wiped out. He got his shot away, but it's a poor ball by Hawkins in the end. It allows Radcliffe to come forward once again with Tom Miller out wide to John Louis. It does well to get past Sh it's Shepard. It's, it's got ball in towards Joe Cummings, but it's headed away by Ibrook. Oh, it's looking back. Oh, it's it's the game. Game. What's a great goal! Luca Navarro! Straight down the keeper. Straight down the middle, but he seems to pass the goalkeeper in his 3-1 Anton. He's blocked the keeper from the edge of the box. How's he managed that? <laughs> Luca Navarro, that's his 11th goal now. It's his second goal in the afternoon. What's a great goal! He's loving it. That's probably... It. Probably one of his best goals that he's got in a Redcliffe shirt, Anton. Without a doubt, he's not, you saw his celebration, he was, he, he he was going to come inside and he's well read by the defender in the end. Navarro knocks down the line here to John Lewis. He races his marker. He's beaten him. He's done well to evade the challenge of Burn. He's done it out there. Very well. It's a free kick to that foot. In a dangerous position there. Matty Crubber is just thinking about his next option. He could take on the shot or he could... He'd probably favour the shot, uh, favour the cross here. If he puts it enough, he's got a ball. Foley! Foley! That's his first goal! Foley! Foley! He sadly got it! Foley is Radcliffe's number four and he is Radcliffe's number four! And Whitby's afternoon goes from bad to worse. They're setting up another change that only only Foley has deserved that goal this season. And so he's been superb. He's been saying it for weeks that like he's been needing a goal. And Massey Grubbers grabs his 16th assist. <laughs> but it's intercepted well by Cy Lanigan. And Callum Grimm does very well there to put it through the legs of Hawkins. And now it's with Luke Navarro who's looking for his hat trick. And it's straight into the arms of the goalkeeper in the end. Yeah, it was three goals in 14 minutes. He looked to break with the substitute Griffiths, but it's a great tackle there by Crobbers. Twice and, and it sends, sends, sends it out towards Navarro, who's already on his way. He's got a box in the bit, center. Got a bit of space here. 
Oh, it's well, that's it, Bas. It's it. Oh, it's for it. Oh, it's just oh, like it was going to be his third. He can't believe it. We can't believe it. He did so well to get past Eibel there. Now with Pritchard. Pritchard sends it in towards. And pushes it down to Crobbers. Crobbers beats his man. And me, that's another one. He does so well there, Crobbers. He's got men over here. It's Grimmin. It comes across. Jack in the null. Oh, it's just got the post, it's headed away by! Now with Oli Thornley, the goal scorer. The other goal scorer. But he, they've lost out here and it's Hawkins to deliver a ball and headed away by Joe Cummings. And now Jack Baxter looks to come up. Looks to come away with it, but it's look, it was a bit of a soft foul there on Dyke still, but the referee's blown up for it. Like I say, it's been a spectator most of the second half. And he's Hazel's take. It's a great goal. Brilliant free kick. It's a great free kick. But you've got to say, it's gone keep the side, so Jack McIntyre will be disappointed that it's gone in that side. Yeah, what's it? I don't think there was a great deal that he could have done it. Just no, nestled but, into but, that far corner, didn't wait, it? From, from where we're sat behind the... Um, Another goal certainly would make this game very nervy as Bland sends it long looking for Hazel. The only goal scorer oh, for Whitby. And now it's green. He's got it's it. Four free. Four Could the come be come back be on? I might have jinxed it, you know. Two goals in two minutes. What, what did I say in the start? About Robson? Yeah, but it's four <laughs> three now. This is, this is Back into play, and we are now. It's another throwing long. It will be Hawkins to take once again. Played away by JP at the first time of asking. Even further away by by Crotters. Kicked away by Fawley. Now Giles on this left hand side. Got a bit of space. He's coming inside. He's still inside. But cleared away by. Oh, another player's gone down. The rest don't see the, the lines have been single, signal for it, so the rest Yeah, it was cleared away, wasn't it, by a Radcliffe body, but yeah. the referee's straight over to the linesman in the end. Yeah. And he's been sent off, Eibel. Eibel's been sent off. Eibel's been sent off and for an early for an early bath in the end, hasn't he? 